Will the gamble pay off? Tonight, two gaming bills appear to stand a chance of actually passing, even though similar measures were repeatedly blocked in the past. So what's changed here, and would you be in favor of it? Let us know on 11live.com slash vote as Doug Richards explains the five big takeaways here. Gambling bills have shuffled through the Georgia legislature for a couple of years now. This year, two bills may get traction. One would allow horse racing in Georgia with paramutual betting on the outcomes. The other would allow casinos with card games and slot machines and that sort of thing. Both would require constitutional amendments, which means a ballot question in November 2020 would put the issue in the hands of Georgia voters. Lawmakers have talked about casinos in major cities like Atlanta and Savannah. Horse racing is touted as benefiting rural Georgia, probably closer to cities like Augusta and Columbus. Gambling supporters say the proceeds would benefit Hope Scholarships. They also would pay for programs to treat gambling addiction. Opponents say that's not worth the benefits. Because it simply allows the people then to decide. During an interview and, uh, on GPB, so, uh, House Speaker David Ralston emphasized he's not a supporter of gambling, but would overlook his reservations to recognize that there is a uh, uh, actually a tremendous amount of support around the state for uh, having uh, uh, one or two casinos here in Georgia. Governor Brian Kemp also describes himself as an opponent of gambling, but has opened a door to letting voters decide. From the Chamber of Commerce supporting... At midday, a House committee approved the casino bill with a minimum of debate and with an eye to next year's election. The biggest hurdles for the gambling bills may be the members of the House and Senate themselves. Both chambers require two-thirds supermajorities for any constitutional amendment. All right, some of you are already talking about this on our Facebook page. Oliver, for example, says, why not make gambling legal? People do it anyway, and Georgia might get some extra tax dollars. Chelsea said she likes the idea of casinos, but horse racing, not so much. It's hmm. been interesting to watch this poll at the bottom of the screen. The longer this poll has been up, the stronger the thumbs up vote has been, and that conversation is still going on strong on the 11 Live Facebook page. So join in. We'll have an update on the conversation and the poll coming up at 6 o'clock.